The Zero Carbon Cities project gave the city of Modena the opportunity to improve its policies on climate, energy and sustainability. Thanks to the Energy and Sustainable Development Agency, for more than one year about 30 local stakeholders met regularly to co-create a vision for the future of our city and to identify strategies to reach carbon neutrality by 2050. SETA manages the local public transport in the province of Modena and is therefore committed to the improvement of the public transport effectiveness and efficiency as a key measure to change the culture of mobility. The planned actions for 2050 will enhance the offer of services through the optimization of journeys, the increase of punctuality and commercial speed, the renewal of the vehicle fleet with more efficient and sustainable means, the implementation of exclusive preferential lanes and the introduction of new smart technology for booking journeys. Furthermore, in the not-so-distant future, it could be possible to develop a test line of self-driving hydrogen buses on a dedicated lane. Energy poverty is one of our challenges to reach carbon neutrality and promote environmental and social justice. To combat it, it is necessary to implement synergic interventions, including informing families, accompany households in identifying the best strategies, and start a dialogue with local, public and private institutions. Therefore, Legambiente and Caritas are launching a pilot project on energy poverty in the Crocetta district in Modena, in order to support the lower-income households in reducing their energy cost and increasing comfort and energy awareness. Activities will include interviews with stakeholders and families, analysis of neighborhood social and structural features, and facilitation activities for an energy community constitution. ISD Modena proposes the realization of eco-sustainable and totally green gyms to promote physical activity with zero energy impact, transforming consumers into prosumers. The gyms will be equipped with sport gear able to transform the kinetic energy produced by muscle activity into electrical energy. By doing so, gyms could produce energy for lighting, cooling or heating the rooms. So, training on a treadmill or a stationary bike could contribute to the carbon neutrality of the city. In addition, each gym could calculate how much carbon dioxide would be avoided in the atmosphere for each kilowatt hour of electricity saved. This initiative is important not only for the environment, but also for people's health in the perspective to reduce the cost for diseases related to overweight and obesity. Within the Zero Carbon Cities project, University of Modern and Reggio Emilia aims to develop three pilot actions to strengthen the knowledge, education and research on sustainability. The first is to open to citizens the cross-cutting skills on sustainability training course and to identify sustainability targets for all courses offered by the university. The second proposal is the creation of a green office to coordinate all the activities related to sustainability inside the university, for example, mobility, charging station for electric cars, and carbon footprint. Finally, the research activities will support the energy transition focusing on the Interdepartmental Center on Hydrogen, life cycle assessment for different types of materials, renewable energy and energy saving, and urban islands.